East Finchley was voted one of the best places to live in the UK by the Sunday Times in 2019, with direct transport links into the city, as well as a bustling high street of local shops, restaurants and even one of the UK's oldest independent cinemas, it's no surprise that the area attracts much popularity. But it's a town of two divides. North of N2, you will discover the Strawberry Vale Estate. Built in 1980, it is made up of 280 social homes, many of which are overcrowded and dated. Last year, it was revealed that the estate ranked within the top 11% of most deprived areas in the UK. But 10 minutes away, you will discover the Bishop's Avenue, aka Billionaire's Row which claims a property portfolio worth a combined value of £350 million. From Saudi princes to politicians, Billionaire's Row has housed some of the wealthiest people on the planet, including Justin Bieber, who rented this mansion in 2016 for a staggering £108,000 a month. Despite its grandeur, many of the houses on Bishop's Avenue remain vacant. Some are derelict and have been left in a state of disrepair. But demand for properties have boomed in spite of the pandemic as wealthy Middle Eastern investors bid for a patch on the famous road. But nearby, on Strawberry Vale, austerity has intensified during coronavirus as residents have been hit by income cuts, unemployment and food poverty. A second food bank opened in the area in May. Speaking of East Finchley's socio-economic divide, local Labour councillor Anjan Mitra said... The gap between rich and poor is getting wider. Bishop's Avenue is a classic example of the decay that inequality brings. 